Hey y'all, I wanted to share with you one of my newest purchases and why I purchased this. It is a netbook. I've been tempted because I'm one of those people that love technology and love getting my hands on the newest technology out there. So I've been tempted to buy a few things that I don't really have money for. One, of course, is the new iPad that's out there, which is probably about the same size as this netbook. And another would be a picture frame. And um, the other thing I've been wanting is an e-reader. Now, there's the, uh, the Nook, which is the Barnes & Noble, the Kindle, or the Sony e-reader that I'm familiar with out there. And, of course, the iPad's going to be coming out with um, its bookstore in it. And it just seems like there are... Um, a lot of battles going on with regard to e-readers and I don't really want to buy one because uh, they um, none of them has come out in the forefront you can't always share what you purchase um, in one of them with the other because they don't accept each other's formats some of them do some of them don't um, so uh, once you get started on one of them, you're almost stuck with one of them. And I'm going to share with you why uh, this uh, solved my problems. You can see it just fits in the palm of my hand. I can just pick it up just like this and go. Um, some women, if I had a larger purse, this would fit right down into my purse. And um, uh, it, it's just so easy to pick up and go. And so I'm going to open it up here. And I'm going to show you, it starts up really fast, unlike my laptop. <laughs> kind of hard to do a camcorder and do this. Um, there we go. There's a shot. And uh, so I have um, here, I bought a mouse. And there it is on the arm of my chair and I bought a mouse and this is really small it doesn't stick out um, so to pick out a mouse that does that so I can just leave that in there because I am definitely a mouse person and this is running Windows 7 and I have a background here I have off the internet and um, I'll show you some of the things uh, that I have on it I found that Windows 7 starter edition comes on these and it's a little bit of a hassle because it's not the full version. I could buy the full version. Um, it's one reason why uh, these cost less because I don't have the full version of um, Windows on here. But I'm finding I really don't need it. Not for the purposes of a netbook because the netbook isn't meant to be a um, full computer. So I have this program here called um, eSword. It's free on the internet but some of the versions of the Bible you have to buy yourself and this is great because I was getting to where I couldn't read my Bible because the text was so too small for my eyes and so I have um, this I purchased which is the same comments that are in my own Bible and um, purchased the NIV, the message, and um, there's a thing here with daily devotions and uh, bought the Max Lucado one. So I bought think, four plugins to this to make it um, useful for me and I can um, write my own study notes over here uh, as well. And so um, I love that I have my Bible handy. I can take it with me wherever I go. Um, I, you cannot change the background on this Windows 7, but I went online, you know, because I just know there's always a way to do everything. And I found a program uh, that I downloaded and installed that allowed me to change the backgrounds. And um, I'm also... Um, able to go into personalize um, screen savers. I'm going to go in here. I think I am. Oh, is it opening up over here? Yep. 
And here's my uh, screensaver setting. And I actually have it set as the Windows Live Photo Gallery screensaver. And it's set to come on every um, five minutes. And if you click, it's hard to record and use your mouse at the same time. If you click on settings, um, you have these choices here. And I have pan and zoom, which makes it um, come in and out like it would on a picture frame. And I bought a picture frame. So when my screensaver comes up, it goes through all of my photos in um, my uh, certain folder that I have this set to. Um, what I also have is the internet so I can get on the internet at any time um, and uh, go into Twitter or anywhere else from here so any of those apps that you would be using on your iPhone or your iPad uh, you can um, utilize right here by connecting to any Wi-Fi connection and you don't have to pay that extra money it costs extra money on the iPad to get the uh, bigger uh, version to in order to do that but what else I have here then is the Kindle reader Kindle now has a um, PC version and um, you can see it opening up here and um, I only have one thing here I need to choose something to purchase but I haven't purchased anything I just got one um, free little book here but you can see um, that the Kindle uh, has a reader that I can um, sit here and uh, read and if I click on uh, show notes um, I can make notes and highlight well maybe not this version can't highlight but it reads just like the other reader and then here's um, the Barnes and Noble reader so if there's a book on Kindle on Amazon um, that I want I'm going to go and uh, look on the Barnes and Noble to see if the price is any cheaper there so um, I can read both of them from the same thing go to chapter one I found that this uh, to be easier to read than what Kindle was offering and so um, but you can also highlight and make notes and things here in this program um, so if I want oh it has a newer version I'll have to update that in a little bit uh, remind me later. So if I want, um, I can go and get books at either uh, one of the stores and have them on one machine here. Um, I also have uh, minutes, so when I go um, to church and I take minutes as secretary, I can um, just <laughs> get rid of the lights. I can just open up a text document. Um, I don't even have Word or anything on here because all I got to do is type text. That's all I need is something to type text and then um, move this over to my uh, laptop um, where I have all of my other files when I get home. Um, the w only thing that the netbook doesn't do that another kind of laptop would do is that it has no um, disk drive. And so you can't. Um, install programs unless you install them from uh, downloading off the internet and, but it's not meant to be that it's just meant to be um, you know a reader uh, being on the internet and doing simple things and I I'm really happy with it it does do all those simple things that I was wanting it to do I'm no longer tempted to buy an iPad a picture frame or a um, uh, an e-reader because I have it all right here and I'm absolutely um, loving it so um, I hope that this has helped you out and uh, uh, helped you to think through some of the the things that are out there bye